And welcome back to the four o'clock show. As Earth Day approaches, a new poll reveals Americans want to learn about solutions that work to address climate change in their communities. Today, I spoke with Walton Family Foundation Communications Director Daphne Moore about that effort. Daphne Moore from the Walton Family Foundation, uh, thanks so much for joining us. Uh, we appreciate it. Saturday is Earth Day. I know there's a new morning consult poll out. Uh, what's your takeaway? What really do you think is the important information that came out of that? Yeah, and thank you for having me. Um, looking forward to this conversation on what's a really important topic. What we found is that uh, about three out of five Americans really look to local news for information um, about the impacts of climate change, but also potential solutions to address those impacts. And what we feel at the Walton Family Foundation is a lot of us are, are feeling those impacts through water. Um, in the West, it's drought and fires, um, flooding, I think, um, we see that across the country. And then in coastal communities, um, you know, the impacts of, of rising oceans. Um, so we're all feeling it in different ways. And I think um, a majority of, of folks really just want good fact-based information about not only the impacts and how it's impacting their community, but also just some of the really creative um, and innovative solutions that are popping up all over. I mean, we we really believe that the people who are closest to the challenge are also the ones who have uh, the best ideas regarding solutions. And so we're excited about that. And it seems uh, if I look at the three broadcast networks and uh, some of the cable news uh, networks, uh, the Washington Post, New York Times, they all, I think, have made pretty much a commitment to covering climate change. You're saying there, uh, your data reveals that local news needs to do a better job of it? Um, I think there's appetite for more information, but we also recognize that there's a challenge there, and that is that newsrooms are doing more with less. Um, and so foundations like ours are um, stepping up to provide philanthropic support that helps to create the capacity for this type of coverage, but also to develop the the expertise that is necessary to break down, you know, some pretty complex topics. In terms of solutions uh, at the Walton Family Foundation, uh, what are some of the important and exciting things available now and on mm -hmm. the horizon? Yeah, I mean, our our founder Sam Walton believed that just great ideas are everywhere if you just stop and look for them. And uh, we're finding that to be true in our philanthropic work as well. Uh, in the West, one of the things that I think is really exciting is um, the restoration of beaver habitat um, along the Colorado basin. So they're not just cute, but beaver habitat is, is actually helping to rehydrate the wetlands um, in the Colorado Basin, which provides drinking water to 40 million Americans. Uh, Earth Day coming up Saturday. Uh, Daphne, uh, thanks so much for being with us. We uh, certainly appreciate it. Thank you.